So and welcome to another Tech Tuesday, where we go through game peripherals and other technologies like Olympus cameras, for instance. So today we're going to be looking at the Stargazer from Razer, which is a 720 60 FPS webcam. This has recently been released to compete with the Logitech C922. So the boxing's very nice from Razer. It's kind of a matte finish. I'm in green and black, as you can see here. Inside the box, we come to the standard Razer welcome letter in this tracing paper. Each one of the Razer products comes with this at the moment. And you also get this kind of cover, I guess, to protect the Razer webcam. It's like a piece of cloth. So take a look at the webcam. It's quite heavy. Um, and it's also quite large compared to the Logitech. But straight off the bat, its build quality is very good. You can tell here it's got these little spikes on the end to uh, kind of finish off the camera. And it's got very you've got three lenses built into it. It's made out of aluminium and it's in a black matte finish. On the rear, you can see the microphone there. So it's got a very similar clasp to what webcams we've seen recently that fits on the monitor. It's got this fold out clasp that kind of latches onto the top of a monitor. It's also got this bespoke connector here from Razer and this standard tripod mount. As always, comes well packaged, nice phone protector here. It comes with the Stargazer manual. Also includes this sense depth and it's got a 3D camera built into it. I think it retails at £149 UK, which is about $149 in the US. Comes with the standard Razer stickers here. These ones are green. Not the Chrome ones that we've seen recently as well. And it comes with its own USB cable. This is tailored to this. It has this uh, standard USB connection. It's braided. The thickness is quite thick. It's similar to the Black Widow cable keyboard. Um, it's not thin. It comes with these little rubber tabs usually that Razer provide. And it has a standard USB cover port, like I say, on this Razer's bespoke one. Um, you'll see a bit clearer in the next picture. Here's the standard USB. The thing I'd like to have seen here is the USB to be green inside. Razor do that with some of their products, but this one's black. So, as always, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Let me know in the comments here if you want to see something else unboxed. I'll catch you all later. Cheers. Bye bye.